Someone is moving in very, very slowly, cautiously, carefully. This is someone who's coming in with an offer, Aries, or you're wanting to make an offer to someone. That's that's like the slowest moving deck, mo slowest moving knight of the deck. That 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 guy's not on a horse, by the way. He's on a tortoise. Yeah, that's really slow as fuck. Well. But yeah, it's coming if you have the patience to wait. <laughs> that is. What happened in the past? Three of cups in reverse happened in the past. Could be um, someone cheating. Could be a third party involved. Could be too many people involved. Or this could just be no reconciliation. Maybe someone's over drinking, partying a, a lot. What's happening right now? We have the six of wands in reverse. Lack of uh, this is someone uh, who's not being able to move on. Okay, this is someone who there's a lack of success. Okay, whatever. If you were in a relationship with someone, something's not moving forward. This is a lack of public recognition. Things are not moving forward successfully as much as you wanted it to. Could be dealing with someone very, very stubborn or someone who very arrogant. Doesn't have to be, but I'm just gonna put it out there. What's in your mind? You're emotionally cold. You're emotionally shut off. You're not emo you're not offering your emotions to this person. No compassion. Nothing at all. No love. Shut down. Locked down. Quarantined. <laughs> so this is happening because someone just lost the passion. Or there could be someone, a player involved. Okay, Knight of Wands in reverse is definitely someone fickle. Okay, guys, I'm sorry. But this is someone who's pl a player. Doesn't have to go play energy. But someone, you know, like one moment they want you, the second moment they don't. One moment they're passionate about you, the second moment they're not. This is very inconsistent. Someone who's just in and out, in and out of your life. Okay? And that's why there's a lack of public recognition. Public recognition. There's a lack of success. Forward moment here. All right. <clears throat> someone wants to come in and apologize. Maybe that's why things are happening. Either someone wants to communicate or they want to apologize for their behavior in the past. I feel more of an apology. It could be an, a younger water sign. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. And what you'll experience in the near future is you're going to be single, independent. And you're like, um, no, thank you. <laughs> Let's see. All right. Clap for the Knight of Pentacles. Why is the Knight of Pentacles as the overall energy for Aries, please? Clever the Knight of Pentacles is the overall energy for Aries, please. Yeah. Someone's moving on from past regret. This is someone who's coming out of that uh, negative zone. There could have been someone who's just like grieving the past or someone who's crying over spilt milk and someone who's just like in the past, you know, like forever living in the past. But they're moving over it. They're like, you know what? That's fine. I'm moving forward. Could be a lot of regret. Okay, someone could have been like regretting a lot, or maybe there's someone who's moving into slow, and you're like, you know what, fuck it. I think this is you who's like, you know what, I'm moving forward. I'm not staying in that zone anymore. I've had enough. Try for the five of cups in reverse. Try for the five of cups in reverse, please. Try for the five of cups in reverse. Yeah. yeah, you're emotionally shut down. You're suppressing your emotions. I don't think you want to give this a second chance. I think you're just like good. You, the, the Ace of Cups in Reverse is like, you know, depression, sadness. But I feel this is you who's not offering your cup anymore. You know what? Like I did this in the past. I regret it. I was in that zone for a very long time. And now you can fuck your pentacle. Sorry. One second. Sorry, the card flipped already. Right. Let's see. What happened in the past? Why is the Three of Cups in Reverse in the past? Why is the Three of Cups in Reverse for the past? Okay, someone made it. Someone needed to pick a direction. Maybe they. Half of the two of wands. Let's see. This is someone who is, you know, like I don't know what to do. You know, that's why I feel there was a lack of reconciliation. Okay, someone probably wasn't just on the same page. Okay, this person probably just wanted to date other people or just wanted to just like give it some more time. But there was a lack of reconciliation in the past. Someone had to pick a direction. Which way do I go? Which way do I go? Clarify the two of wands. Whoever this person is, they, they this is someone who is a very who makes a very detached decision. You know, like they this is like someone who's halfway in, halfway out. Okay. Clarify the two of wands. Clarify the two of wands. Okay. We have the sun here. What I can see is that you probably gave up on this person. You turned it turned out to be that this person is really not on the same page with you. There could have been something that was. Uh, could be a cancer reunion that happened and finally you made a decision you've had enough you had to pick a decision 
uh, you had to, uh, you were almost there, but then you know what? I think you made up your mind and you're like, you know what? Nah, I'm good. Clarify the sun. Why is the sun here? You're feeling, you were quite happy in the past, probably. After the cancer reunion. <laughs> That's new. Clarify the sun. Clarify the sun. Could be dealing with a Leo. Yeah. And the moment you were happy, optimistic, you were fine living your life, brighter days were there, and there the five of pentacles under was, and there they returned back with their asses. This is someone who wants to return back after being left out in the cold or after abandoning you. Someone who you abandoned, see, like I said, right, you had to make a decision. You were halfway in, halfway out, and you had a cancer for you, and you were like, you know what, no, I don't want this reconciliation anymore. You made up your mind, you were happy, you were very confident about your decision, and then there they want to return back. If this is not someone returning back, the Five of Pentacles and Reverse can also be you just trying to move forward, okay? Getting out of that whatever zone of whoever has been abandoned. Take it how it resonates, like I say. Clarify like the Six of Wands and Reverse. Clarify like the Six of Wands and Reverse as the current energy. Why is the current situation the Six of Wands and Reverse? Yeah, there's no lack of forward moment because someone's being very wishy-washy. We have the Two of Pentacles here. Someone doesn't know what they want, or this is just someone trying to juggle two things, or two situations, two people, could be anything. Could be a decision that they're juggling. Should I invest? Should I not? Should I invest? Should I not? Should I wait? Should I not? Okay, with the two of pentacles. This is someone who could also be multitasking, okay? Could be a lot on their mind. Okay, for the two of pentacles. There's a lack of forward movement. Maybe someone's just trying to juggle. Okay, so is someone in a marriage here? This is marriage. This is definitely this is definitely marriage. This is commitment. Maybe someone could be dealing with someone who's already married, although I don't get a lot out here, but yeah. But let's see, we have the three of cups in reverse in the past, so that is definitely a third party situation. I did put cheating out there, but I wasn't sure. So there was definitely a third person involved and now there's a lack of forward moment because there's someone who's still trying to juggle a marriage situation. Clap for the four of wands. What is this four of wands situation? Clap for the four of wands, please. Yeah, but then they're stuck on you. I think you're stuck on this person, Aries, or this person is stuck on you. All right, you're not being able to move forward. This is someone who's still in that turmoil, you know, someone in that situation. They're just not being able to move away from this player. You're not being able to move away from this player. Because we have the Knight of Wands in reverse here. We have the Three of Cups in reverse here. I mean, like, what's going on? How about the Knight of Wands in reverse? Why is the Knight of Wands in reverse influencing the current situation? How about the Knight of Wands in reverse? Who is this Knight of Wands in reverse? But this Knight of Wands in reverse is doing things that make him happy. I'm sorry, Aries. This is someone who is a little smug, very smug actually. They just do things that make them happy. They come in, they come out, they come in, they come out, they come in when things make them happy. They come in when they please, they leave when they please. This is someone extremely smug. Does someone like this make you happy? They're very emotionally dependent on you, you know. They're fickle. They want their emotional happiness from you. They take what they want from you and they leave. If that's how, if this is what I'm reading for the Aries who are watching it, a few of them. Clarify for the Nine of Cups. Clarify for the Nine of Cups. See? 100%. This is cheating too. Again, look. This is someone who's just choosing things to do that is not right. The levels in reverse is disconnected. The sex may be very good, but this is someone who's just uh, this feeling disconnected right now. Or you're feeling disconnected. You could have thought this person is a soulmate. You could be dealing with a fixed sign Gemini. Sorry, not a fixed sign. This is, you could be dealing with a Gemini. I'm sorry, Gemini is not a fixed sign. But yeah, you could be dealing with a Gemini. But whoever this guy is, this guy is smug. Guy or girl, whoever this is, they rush in when they want to. They get what they want. They gather emotionally. They get their cups filled and they leave. You're already feeling disconnected from this person. Maybe this is just a lot of passion, a lot of sex, but I don't say love you. Clap for the lovers in reverse. Please clap for the lovers in reverse. Let's have one more card for the lovers in reverse. This is someone who's constantly, knowingly making the wrong choice, I think. Clap for the lovers in reverse. Clap for the lovers in reverse. See? Now again, we want to rush in and talk. This is someone who just wants to, you know, 
so, so they want to come they want to leave they want to come they want to leave they make right they make wrong choices they make choices according to what makes them happy they want to rush in and talk now clap at the night of swords clap at the night of swords see but then you're not putting in the effort anymore we have the eight of pentacles in reverse you're not focusing on this relationship at all you're focusing on everything else except this relationship this is some either you're being a workaholic and you're just trying to dig your hand into some work you're putting your head down and working you're just not giving it to this connection and now they want to come in and talk that sucks Clap the queen of cups in reverse why is the queen of cups in reverse on aries mind Clap for the queen of cups in reverse you are emotionally shut down you're being cold you're being distant you don't want to talk to this person you're like fuck off don't show me your face ever again because now i have clarity you have the ace of wands the ace of swords i'm sorry you have clarity you have the truth coming out right on your face the universe smacked you on your face with the truth you have clarity you know what's going on you see things for how they are clap for the ace of swords this is like cutthroat communication even if it's not communication it's just you seeing things very clearly clap for the ace of swords you could have been stuck in sanity for a very long time because i feel i i see ace of swords as like more like a breakthrough you know clap for the ace of swords yeah clap for the ace of swords please yeah you cut them out aries you cut their ass out look you have the king of swords you have two cards for clarity the king of swords is called i see detached they make a very logical decision they're not they don't think from their heart they think from their uh, uh they, they think with their minds their logic their reasoning they're very rational maybe you see things very very clearly now and you know what you're like i don't know i don't care i'm done bye clarify for the king of swords clarify for the king of swords please you're definitely cutting someone out clarify for the king of swords That's the king of swords, please. Yeah, because you thought there were a lot of secrets around. We have the moon. You could be dealing with a Pisces. You thought this person was always a mystery, or you always thought there was something always hidden about this person. Okay, or there was always a fear of the unknown with this person. Like you just didn't know where this relationship was going. You were always like in two minds, or you thought they were juggling, or you were juggling. You just didn't know what was happening. You're like, you know what? No, and there could have been a lot of stress, fear, anxiety related to this. You know. Clap for the page of cup. See, I didn't even ask. And we have the star in reverse. Could be dealing with an Aquarius, but now you've completely lost hope and faith. This is you feel this is a hopeless situation. Nothing's happening ever. This could have been a divine connection. We had the star here, but yeah, you lose. You, you've completely lost hope and faith in this connection. I think you've just cut them out. Like no, not happening anymore. I'm done with your secrets and whatever is hidden and your intentions. You never have everything put down. Every nothing was on. Everything was wasn't on the table. You know, you, there was always something missing, and it kept you wondering and thinking. Clap for the page of cups. Why is why is the page of cups? Why the why is the page of cups here? Why is the page of cups here? Yeah. Now they want to come in and communicate with you. Why? because they are the devil they're feeling very tied bound and restricted to you look this guy could be this guy or girl this person could be obsessed with you you could be obsessed with them could be dealing with a capricorn but now they're coming in to apologize i feel it's more of an apology because they feel very tied and bound to you they feel they, they can't shake this connection this is unhealthy guys just to let you know you're not being able, you're not going to be able to shake out this connection because it's the devil here have for the devil Clap for the devil, please. Yeah. Or maybe the other way of looking at it is that maybe this person wants to come and con communicate with you that they feel stuck, tied, restricted, and bounded to a marriage. Ten of Pentacles is to do with marriage. It's commitment. Maybe they're already committed somewhere else. They're married somewhere else. They're engaged. Whatever it is, I think this is marriage. But they're already restricted and bound to someone else. But they still want to talk to you. You know when the page of cups comes in, right? It's someone who is not who who is still in the fantasy world. You know, like I am married to someone, and I still want to communicate with the third person. But the reality is, and I want to live in my fantasy world by communicating with that third person, right? Like, oh yeah, I I like you. I want to do this. But the truth is that you are still married. So how do you even expect something else to happen? That's the page of cups. You know, page of cups is always that very dreamy energy. You know, like they don't want to do page of cups is more like you know what like. 
more of a dreamer than it work okay like yeah let's talk let's 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 try let you know but, but the thing is that they're already bound and restricted to this pentacle the 10 of pentacles they're bound in a commitment or a marriage anyways class of the 10 of pentacles please class of the 10 of pentacles yeah but you're not communicating you're like i'm done you're like no the fuck i am not talking to you Get the fuck out of my face! I'm not talking. You have the page of wands in reverse. You have no motivation, no passion, no inclination, nothing, nothing to talk to them. You have nothing. You're done. I feel more like you're done. I'm out. That's when the future. I see the nine of pentacles. This is single, independent. I am enough. I am okay if I'm in a relationship. I'm okay if I'm not in a relationship. I am the ship. Like nine of pentacles. Clap for the nine of pentacles in the future. Yeah, you're done waiting for this shitty person to come back. You could have manifested this person, manifested this connection for a very long time. This is someone who waits, 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 and waits. And now you're giving up. You're not waiting no more. You're not waiting any more for their ships to come in. Clap at the three of wands in reverse. Something just didn't manifest, probably. Clap at the three of wands in reverse. And. could be because someone someone needs and probably someone needs to leave a family situation i feel this is someone who needs to leave a marriage or needs to, needs to leave a family situation or maybe someone just did they just did they chose the family or the other whoever they were with instead of you and you're like done waiting clap for the 10 of cups in reverse clap for the 10 of cups in reverse and now you're not taking action Either you're not taking any action anymore. You're just like you know what, fuck it. See, look, uh, the page of wands in reverse is why the readings also happening. Queen of wands in reverse is in the future. I don't see you taking any action, your Aries. That's fire, is your Sagittarius. You're not taking action. You're losing the passion. Maybe earlier you were the Queen of Wands. You were trying to make shit happen. Like you know what, you have that go for it vibe, and now you're not. The, someone just killed your vibe. You know. And you're like what? No, I'm not having this. You make a decision. You're with me, or you're with them. And I think they chose them, or they're just stuck in that marriage. And now you know what? I'm sick and tired of waiting. I can't do this anymore. And now you're like, you know what? I I, I don't want to do this anymore. You're not taking any action. You've lost the passion. You're just letting things happen. You know, you're like, you know what? I'm gonna just sit here with my bag of chips. I'm just gonna see if things happen. They happen. If they don't, that's fine. I'm okay. Clap for the Queen of Wands in reverse. Clap for the Queen of Wands in reverse. Clap for the Queen of Wands in reverse, please. You're moving forward, babe. You're moving forward. This is someone who is very focused, determined. Very that they have like this razor sharp focus. Okay, whatever they know what their goal is. They're like full speed. That's not a chariot. They're not on a horse. You know that 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 person is on a jet. I think they're going full speed. And this is someone who doesn't like to be stopped. Like you're not stopping me. No one's stopping me. I'm not gonna let anyone stop me. No one comes in my way. You're moving forward. You're showing them the middle finger. You're moving forward. That's the goal. That's the way to go, babe. Babe, bro, whoever it is, I love that. Yeah, I mean, you've been going through a lot. I feel. I mean, you know what? I really feel you, Aries. I really feel you. I mean, I understand what's going on, and now you're just so shut down. But yeah, you're doing good for yourself. You're you're doing what's good for you, and and I'm glad. But I'm up to date. We have the Ace of Pentacles in reverse. Probably there was no new beginning with this person, okay? Because someone did not have the courage. They just didn't feel secure in this connection. Someone was not offering security, stability out here, and that's where things just didn't move forward. And after you cut them out, they want to come in again. But now you're not investing into this anymore. You're moving forward. You're doing what's good for you. You're more focused on your goals. You're just, you know what? Bye bye. All right, Aries. I hope you enjoyed this reading. Please like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.